in this Pioneer DJ CDJ 2000 Nexus 2 tutorial the waveform of the CDJ 2000 Nexus 2 how can you zoom in and out of the waveform how you can change the color of the waveform how you can needle search in a track and see if hot cues are loaded into the memory of your CDJ 2000 Nexus 2 the CDJ represents you with two waveforms the first one is over here that is the big waveform the zoomed in waveform and on the bottom of the screen there is the zoomed out waveform the total view of a track when i play the track you'll see that a needle is walking through the song this is the part that is still coming up and here you see the detailed view if you want to zoom in on this view you can do that with the scroll button zoom out left and zoom in right you can jump to certain sections in a song by clicking it with your finger on the screen itself in the lower waveform for example I want to go over here I can see a preview of what is coming up in the track remember the track is right here the playhead is over here and when I want to go to that section in the track the track keeps playing it's just a preview when I go to that section I can press the play button and that will pause the track you'll still hear it and it jumps right to the part of the track that I'm holding with my finger if I now let go of my finger the track will stop before I can continue play I have to play press the play button again when I want to jump back in the track over here for example press the pause button and if I press it again it continues playing Let's do it again, I come over here, I want to jump to uh, this part in the song, when I press it once, it will jump to that part in the song, when I release my finger, it will stop, but when I click the play button again, it will continue playing, even if I release my finger. If you want to change the waveform color, you can do that in the shortcut menu. The shortcut is over here. When I click it, there is an option over here that says waveform blue or RGB. And you can change it to RGB. Personally, my personal preference, um, the base is red and I can see it more easily on the RGB waveform than on the blue waveform. When I go back you'll see that the waveform over here is also changed. When you look at the screen you see that there are a couple of items over here. Those uh, E, F, B, A markings are the hot cues and if the hot cues are in the song they are displayed on top of the track over here when they are loaded into the memory then they are on the bottom of the track in this case they are on top and on the bottom so the hot cues are loaded in if you don't want to auto load your hot cues can you can go to shortcut and switch the hot cue auto load to off now let's go back or press the shortcut again and now it won't load the next time I won't, uh, will load in a new song. Then these markings on the bottom will disappear. They are only then on the top of the track. You can load in again a hot cue if you want to by using the call button and pressing the name of the hot cue. It will directly immediately jump in the song to that hot cue. I assembled a playlist with all my CDJ 2000 Nexus 2 tutorials. A link here in the screen and also I will put a link down in the description below.